Good morning, hot dogs. And welcome to the morning announcements. Babysitting, Barack Obama, and a lot more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Youth from 5th through 12th grade are welcome to attend the babysitting Clinton County Spark Club of the Purdue Extension Office. There will be a cost of $40 per person. Each attendee will be CPR certified, involved in discussion on first aid training, child care how-tos, and even how to grow your business. Space is very limited, so reserve your spot by calling the Extension Office at 765-659-6380 extension X 1816. Make checks payable to Clinton County Purdue Extension and make sure to RSVP by November 22nd. The 10th annual Indiana Latino Education Summit in College and Career Fair is virtual this year. It is on Saturday, November 6th from 10 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. Find out about the college application process, financial aid, and meet with college representatives live. When you register, you are automatically entered for a chance to win laptops, iPads, and gift cards. If you have any more questions, see Mrs. Johnson in room 129. Now, let's head into weather and sports. What's up, dogs? It's Thursday, one more day. Today for sports, we have basketball and volleyball. The girls' basketball team faced Carroll last night for the season opener. The dogs fell to Carroll 67-28. The girls will be back on the road on Saturday to face Fountain Central. Next up, the boys volleyball team traveled to Prairie last night to face Rossville. The dogs fell to Rossville losing the first set 25 to 15 and losing the second set 25 to 23. We'd like to thank everyone who came out and supported the event. That's all for Sports Dogs. Make sure to have a terrific Thursday, not at AV, with weather. Thank you, Nelson. Hope you guys are having a good morning because it is freezing. Today's temperature is 28 degrees with a low of 26 and a high of 46. The only good thing about today's weather is that it's going to be clear skies for today. That's all for your weather. Now back to your host, dogs. The Clinton County Youth Community Engagement Council is being created to assist and create strategic goals and objectives for the direction of the community from the youth perspective. This select group of young people will participate in leadership training, meet monthly to outline a vision that ultimately may be added to a community plan and work on specific projects for the betterment of the community. The council will include students from all five Clinton County High Schools who will work together for the betterment of the community. A mission statement and expected outcomes are available with the application. Applications are available in student services and are to be completed and returned to Ms. McGuire by Friday, November 5th at the end of the school day. The Alliance has a new club at FHS for LGBTQ plus students and allies. This club is student ran and will provide a safe space to meet and participate in meaningful discussions while getting to know other students. The club will meet on the first and third Thursday of the month in room 303. See Mrs. McGuire or Miss Evans for more information. A happy birthday goes out to Jordan Frazier and Brian Sarabia. Happy birthday guys. Did you know that on this day in 2008, Barack Obama was elected as America's first black president? He defeated Senator John McCain of Arizona to become the 44th U.S. president and the first African American elected to the White House. The 47-year-old Democrat gathered 365 electoral votes and nearly 53% of the popular votes. Anyways, hot dogs, that's all for the announcements. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you want more of us.